Hey, Mark Nelson here. And today what I want to do is I want to share some tips on how to start a coaching business in 2023. Now, I've been very fortunate because I started my coaching business. It's one of the most thrilling and one of the most feel good things I've ever done in my life. So if you want to start a coaching business, right, you've never done it before, or even if you have done it or you're starting, I want you to answer these three questions. Who are you going to help? That's the first one. What are you going to help them with? And then how are you going to help them? Now that sounds simple, but in all reality, you need to be able to answer those questions when you get started. Who are you gonna help? Couples, single women, teachers. What are you gonna help them with? All right, what problem do they need helping with? And then how are you gonna help them with that? So you have to get those thoughts down and I would actually write them down on paper. And the second thing you need to do, that's just the first one. The second thing you need to do is, one is you need to get a strategy for getting clients. Now, today's world's different because I believe like 20 years ago, shoot, five years ago, there are a lot of networking events around and you could go network with people and talk to them. Well, now more and more of it's done online. And online, there's actually two strategies. One, you can put out content. Whatever platform you're on, Put out valuable content about the problems you're going to help people with and create some activity. When people start looking at that content, reach out to them. The second way is to go into groups, right? Friend some people and start sending them direct messages. But you got to be careful with that because you can, two things, you become into a friend zone real quick and also you can alienate some people. You know, if you're pushy, people are going to back away from you. So answer those questions. Find a strategy to get clients. And then the third step is you need to design a package. Now, I've changed packages. When I started, and when you start, you might want to offer something a little lower price than what you end up with. Okay, so it, it doesn't matter what it is, but start thinking, is the three-month package, is it one-on-one -on -one coaching, is it group coaching, is it $150 a call, are you going to do three months for $2,000, $3,000, $1,000, three calls a, a month or four calls a month, but think of designing a package and get ready to talk to people about. Now, here's the big one. What you want to do is learn how to schedule a free coaching session. Now I've talked about this in other videos. Now you can have a coaching session. When I started out a clarity call and a discovery call and a free chatting session with my, I don't even know what I called, but I changed it. I, you need to have a unique name. So what I decided to go with is double your sales and profit free coaching session because I want to talk to people who are trying to build businesses. That's where my strength is. Now, if you're in weight loss, how to lose 10 pounds in 30 days, free coaching session. If your relationships, how to find your perfect match in 30 days, free coaching session. You know, I'm making those up on the go, but you get it. Just change. Instead of a clarity call and discovery call, put a unique name on it. So people actually know what they're going to, talk to you about. They want to find out what you are going to talk to them about and it's actually going to bring down the crowd. Remember that first question, who are you talking with? Well, that discovery call is going to help when you name it a unique name. Now, the fifth one you got to do, you got to sign them up. And I know a lot of people get scared about that, but it's easier than you think. One of the first coaches I signed up with, I reached out to him. But I was talking to another guy and we were just jabbering. I was not going to sign up for his program. There was no way in heck. And the more we talked, all of a sudden said, hey, do you want to work together? Yeah. And I signed up on the spot. I didn't have the money. I didn't want to do it. 
But you know, there was a connection there. And that's what happened in that free coaching call. He coached me for a while. So when you sign them up, you have to be ready to say, hey, John, I think I got something that will really help you. You want to take a look at it? Or what that Jim Cox did. What he said was, hey, you want to work together? Yeah, that's all it is. And then be ready to sign them up. Be ready to take a credit card, send a contract to them. But that's it. So, if you're thinking of starting a coaching business in 2023, here's what you need to do. Answer those three questions. Who are you going to serve? What are you going to help them with? And then how are you going to help them? Find a strategy to get in front of people. Social media, networking events, Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, get in front of people. Design your starting package so you know what it is and why I'm saying that so when you get on this free coaching session, right, you can talk to them about it and sign them up. Hey, here's what I got for you. Know what you're going to offer them. So there you have it. Hey, down below, I have a couple links. One, a free PDF on how to escape your nine to five. Two, schedule a call. How to double your sales and profits. Free coaching session. Hey, y'all take care. We will talk again soon. Bye.